I'm Simon Chowdhury. It's Sunday, September 6th, and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. Demonstrators took to the streets of Detroit for the 100th night in a row. They celebrated a judge's order preventing police from using things like tear gas and rubber bullets for two weeks. Detroit police say they have only used force on violent demonstrators. Protesters say they will go to court to try and make the judge's decision permanent. A tragedy on Detroit's west side. A two-year-old boy is dead after a crash Friday on 8 Mile near Cherry Lawn. Four people are still in critical condition, including two other children. One witness tells 7 Action News she heard a screech and then a loud boom. Police are still investigating. Well, it's going to be a busy week of campaigning with the presidential candidates here in Michigan. Democratic nominee Joe Biden will be in our state Wednesday. No word yet on the location. President Trump is coming to Michigan on Thursday for a rally in the Saginaw area. The well, temperatures on the cooler side today, low to mid 70s, a chance for a shower this afternoon, but a better chance for stronger storms uh, late tonight after about 10 p.m. until 5 in the morning. Could even get some damaging wind gusts. And then for your Labor Day Monday, a few showers in the morning. It may even find a stray shower for the afternoon just with some instability, but most of us will stay dry. Temperatures in the mid to upper 70s and then a cool down for Tuesday. Highs only near 70.